Welcome to my channel. So this is day 11 of 21 days meditation for beginners journey. How to calm my anxious mind. I am going to proceed in this discussion with the premise that you went through day 1 to 7 of the meditation for beginners journey where the nitty-gritty of meditation is explained, especially the interconnectivity of the body, the mind, and spirit, or that you already tried meditating. This is not for a total newbie on meditation. The mind is not the brain. It's the non-physical part of us that holds the record of all that we saw, heard, felt, experienced, valued, and believed where all the programming that we received in our lifetime are stored and the basis of our day-to-day decision-making. Science came up with the validation that we are bombarded with an average of 65,000 thoughts per day. That is why the mind is referred to as the monkey mind or always in motion. It is the most unruly part of us, the hardest to tame. Thus, the need for daily meditation. The mind is also where dreams are created, where creations, innovations, and discoveries are imagined and visualized first before the physical manifestations are actualized. And this happens effectively if the mind is calm. Calming the mind is the key to control of the mind. Wise men will always be the ruler of their mind, and the fools will always be its slave. Calming the mind is an inside job. We don't need assistance from the outside world. No one can solve our problems for us. We are our own salvation. Why? Because all the truths of the world lie at the core of our being, in our heart and in our mind. So mind is like water. When turbulent or flowing fast, it is difficult to see or even hear clearly. But as it gets slower and slower, calmer and calmer, things become clearer and clearer. Then intuition, infinite intelligence, voice of wisdom, or however you call the divine, arises in the silence or stillness of meditation for our guidance and direction. It is important that you set an intention before you meditate. Play with your thoughts first. Think about everything connected to your intention. You can even list them down. Contemplate on the current intention like your health, business ventures, relationship issues, or whatever you want to accomplish before you go into meditation. When intentions are clear, find a comfortable place where you can meditate for as long as you have decided to do it. Then start your belly breathing 
the breath of life. It's the primary language of the body, mind, and spirit. Drawing air from the environment as they feed and nourish our DNA at the core of our trillions of cells in our body. Breath is also called the dimmer switch because it regulates our nervous system. Our deep inhales stimulates the sympathetic nervous system and our slower exhales stimulates our parasympathetic nervous system. It also resets our vagus nerves for our benefit. The only thing that does not change from birth to death is our breath. Every emotion of fear, anger, doubt, anxiousness, or resentment versus the emotion of love, joy, peace, appreciation, excitement, and gratefulness carries a different kind of breath that activates a different kind of vibration. So start thinking and feeling those positive feelings that resonates with the fulfillment of the intentions you want to accomplish. Your goal is to match the positive vibration of the wish fulfilled to manifest it into existence. Start doing belly breath. The first three breaths can actually start the shift to calm the mind. As you continue even for just five minutes, you should be feeling a difference already in your state of mind. It takes lots of practice because meditation masters can totally shift their state of being in just a minute. Thank you for joining me here. If you resonate with the topic discussed or you have queries, please put in the comments below for feedback. I am so grateful if you'd click the like and subscribe to my channel. It has something to do with YouTube algorithm so they can show this to more people. Service to others is the highest form of fulfillment to the giver. If you have your intentions ready, now, let's start with at least three belly breaths and then you continue on your own, at your own pace. So let's start. Thank you.